division of rational expressions. In order for you to understand this video or this lesson, please make sure that you watch our tutorial videos in multiplication of rational expressions and simplifying rational expressions. Let's have our example number one. If you have 6 over 8 divided by 3 over 5. Okay. So our step is copy our numerator. So in this case, this can be written as 6 over 8 divided by 3 over 5. Okay. They are similar. To solve this kind of fraction, our first step is copy our numerator. In this case, our numerator is 6 over 8. Then proceed in multiplication. That will become times then, get the reciprocal of our denominator. The reciprocal is 5 over 3. Okay. Now, we're going to apply our multiplication rules. In this case, 6 and 3 has a common factor of 3. So... Will become 6 can become 3 times 2, so we can cancel 3 and 3. And 8 has a factor of 4 times 2, so we can cancel 2 and 2. 8 is equivalent to 4 times 2, so change that 8 to 4 times 2, 2 will be cancelled out. Now, our, our final answer is 5 over 4. Let us apply in our polynomials. Let's say we have 5m over n times 2m are uh, divided by, sorry, we are in division, divided by 75. Okay, let's make it bigger, a bigger number. 15 M. 15m over 8n divided by 12m over 75n squared. Let's try number 2. 15m over 8n divided by 12m over 75n squared. Copy our numerator, 15m over 8n, then proceed to multiplication, get the reciprocal, that will become 75n squared all over 12n. Now, let us use our cancellation technique. Our method of cancellation. Um, 15 and 12. Common factors. So 15 can be written as 3 times 5. And 12 can be written as 3 times 4. So 3 and 3 will be cancelled out. Next, um, 
variable m will be cancelled out. Okay. Then n, n squared divided by n, this will become n. So, do we still have numbers to be cancelled out? Okay. Let's now find our final answer. 5 times 75, that is 75 times 5, so 5 carry to 35, 36, 37, so 375. We have N all over 8 times 4. 8, 16, 24, 32. 32. And this is now our final answer. 375 and all over 32. How about this one, number 3? X squared plus 5X minus 14 all over 18x squared divided by x squared minus 49 all over 6x cubed minus 12x squared. Okay. If you want to answer number 3, you can pause the video. Then after answering, resume watching. We are done, let's check your work. Let us factor our numerator. So we have x and x. Factors of negative 14, the sum must be 5. So positive 7, negative 2. 7 times negative 2, negative 14. 7 minus 2, positive 5. All over 18x squared. Then proceed to multiplication. Then reciprocal our denominator. So that will become 6x cubed minus 12x squared. All over x squared minus 49. After getting the reciprocal, let us factor out. So copy, since it is already in factored form, just copy. Now, let us factor. The GCF is 6x squared. So 6x cubed divided by 6x squared. That is x minus 12x squared divided by 6x squared, which is 2. All over difference of two squares, x plus 7, x minus 7. Now, let us use our cancellation method. So we have x plus 7, x plus 7. We have x squared. Copy. Cancel x squared and x squared. And 18 can be written as 6 times 3. Therefore, cancel 6 and cancel 6. Now, the remaining expressions in our numerator are x minus 2, x minus 2, and for our denominator, we have 3 times x minus 7. This is now our final answer. Okay.
or it can be written as x minus 2 squared all over 3 times x minus 7. So that is that is on how to solve division of rational expressions. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV.